In this video, I will give an overview of built-in Mongoose OS RPC services. Uh, what's an RPC service? Essentially, it's a function written in JavaScript or C, which has a unique name. It expects a JSON string with input parameters and outputs back a JSON string with, with the results. Uh, in a previous video, I've shown how to create a custom RPC service to make a device react on commands. Let me briefly cover built-in services. Here I have ESP8266 node MCU connected to my laptop. Uh, start your terminal and install Mongoose OS first. MOS flash MOS-ESP8266. Mongoose OS is installed. And now type MOS call rpc.list. This rpc.list RPC service lists all other uh, registered RPC services. So first we see I2C related services. I2C write register word, which writes a two byte word into the I2C register, writes byte, read word, read byte, uh, write byte string, read byte string, and scan all I2C devices. Then there are GPIO services. First two services remove and set interrupt handler. The GPIO toggle toggles the pin. GPIO write sets the pin and GPIO read. Next go file system services. Remove file, write file, read file and list all files. And by the way, all MLS utility commands just call respective RPC services. Then what we see a configuration calls, saving configuration, getting network status, setting configuration, and getting configuration. Then OTA functions, over-the-air update, uh, getting current boot state, setting boot state, creating snapshot of the current firmware, reverting back to the previous firmware, committing the current firmware, and making the OTA update. Then the system functions, get system, get device information and reboot the device, and then the helper function, uh, like this one that we've just called, rpc.list, uh, and uh, rpc hello just returns the current time, and rpc describe provides a simple introspection into the rpc service. For example, let's take gpio write, type mos, call rpc.describe, and the arguments name equals GPIO write. So what we see here is that GPIO write service expects this JSON string as an input. So the pin number and the value to write. So we can call it MOS call GPIO write the pin number is 16, a built-in LED, and the value is 0 to turn it on because it's inverted. Quotes around. Here we go. So the red built-in uh, GPIO pin is switched on. 